Hello guys, so this is the Xiaomi Mi 8. The code name is Deeper, and in this video, I will show you how to flash the customer recovery and also customer ROM in this phone. Okay, in this tutorial, we're going to use the Pixel Experience based on Android 13. All the files and instructions I will provide in my blog. You can check the link in the description box. Okay, so the Android 13 have a new UI display and it's very nice all the basic functions are working and before you get started make sure to have unlock portfolio report okay so stay tuned and check it out Okay, hello guys. Assalamualaikum. We meet again with Tom Bob. This time we have another Xiaomi phone. This is the Xiaomi Mi 8 with the code name is Deeper. Okay. So in this tutorial, I will show you how to customize this phone using the Pixel Experience Android routine. Okay. Before we get started, let's check the exciting system. <clears throat> Let's go to the settings and about one. You can see right here it's using the latest update. Okay, the last update. The last update is using the Mu 12.0.3 on Android 10. Okay. So you, if you have this one you will get stuck in this Android version so in this tutorial I will show you how to operate the pawn <clears throat> okay as usual the first thing you want to do is unlock bootloader the pawn you can check for my other video on how to unlock Xiaomi pawn okay after you done it go to additional settings developer option and make sure the me unlock status is unlocked that's all then we need to turn off the pawn and boot into the fast boot mode as usual the fast boot mode can be accessed by pressing the volume down and power button at the same time okay still hold the two button until you see the screen okay it means that we are in the fast boot mode Okay, now let's plug the USB cable. Okay, the uh, Type C. And we are ready to go. Okay, let's switch the screen. <clears throat> okay, in here I have several files. Okay, this is the custom ROM. And there is three of the custom ROM. Uh, sorry, I mean we have this custom ROM and three custom recovery. So we're going to use the custom recovery for the from the Pixel Experience because we can directly update using this one. Okay. Now let's open the <coughs> CMD or PowerShell. Okay. Now let's type some comment. Let's type fast food, fast flash, fast recovery, and simply just click and drag the custom recovery. Okay, hit enter. <coughs> and now let's try to boot into the custom recovery. Facebook, Facebook, and uh, that one. And now we are in the customer recovery. Okay, you can see right there. And this is non touch screen. Okay, so you have to use the you have to navigate using the volume up and volume down button and 
hit the power button to do OK. Okay, to press enter. <clears throat> okay, the first thing I want to do is go to the factory set. Okay, let's follow me down, follow me down, follow me down, and power button. Okay, let's select format gas, tap yes, and select format data, format data. <clears throat> okay, then let's go back using the volume up button press the power button and let's try the apply update okay we can use the from adb okay select the adb and hit enter okay now let's go to the pawn again <clears throat> Okay, now let's just type ADB space side load space and just click and drag the click and drag the file. Okay, we're using the Android routine and it will start the process. You can see right there the size is. <clears throat> about 1.8 gigabyte okay so almost 2 gigabytes so it will take time yeah we'll skip this one and we'll continue after it finish and now it's already done okay let's switch the screen again you can see right here it says strip succeed okay go back and let's do another factory set okay it's better to format the data after it finish okay factory set and select format data format data again <clears throat> and now let's go back to the first screen and select reboot system now okay now it should put the pawn using the custom ROM. Okay, let's wait. I want to see that. Okay, now the pawn is booted using the pixel experience boot image. Okay, just for your information, this ROM already contains the gaps, so you don't have to install it. And it's using the Android routine ARM 64. Okay. And now we are in the Android wizard or this home screen. Simply just hit next, next until it goes to the home screen. Okay. You can see right here it has a new display, okay. new system UI. Very refreshing and after this we're going to make a quick review about the rom if it's good enough or not for the ready driver and also maybe if it has a bug or not okay so stay tuned and i hope you like my video if you find it very useful please give it a thumb and i also have last video about routing custom rom and lots of fun okay especially xiaomi samsung realme asus and other stuff okay uh you can find in my video maybe some of the video will be useful for you okay guys if you subscribe it will make me excited to make a new video and that's all Stay self, stay safe, stay health, and wassalamualaikum.